This is a measure, a method to measure the count per volume of the clams that we're growing. So I've taken a hundred clams, including the dead ones, and I've separated them out. And at this glance, we look to have one, two, three, four, five, six out of a hundred that are dead. So we have a six percent mortality. The next step is to put some water into a graduated cylinder. This is a hundred milliliter cylinder and take the 100 clams and put them into the graduated cylinder, both the dead and the alive. Okay. The next step is to tap the clams down. They'll actually move down in the graduated cylinder and get a little more compact. Now, what this shows me is that I have 40 milliliters for 100 clams, and that's the basis for doing the total count. The next thing is to do this two more times and average these uh, total volume of clams of 100 clams in the graduated cylinder. Okay, and are you going to do the water differential as well? No water differential. Water is only in here to allow the clams to seat easily in the, in the graduated cylinder. Okay. The next step is to take a larger beaker and fill them up. Uh, this one holds two liters and take all of the clams that are in the silo and count the total volume of the clams in the silo. And that's dry measure, right? It's a dry measure. To put, you tamp it down so they all seat down. Once you've done this, you know the total volume of the seed in the silo. You can extrapolate from 40 milliliters for 100 clams to the total volume to the total number of clams. Okay, so we then take the total volume divide by the 40 milliliters in this case, and that's going to tell us the number multiplied by 100 of all of the clams in the upweller. That's right. We have provided two different forms to help people understand how to enter data. The first one simply shows the formula and the steps to gather the information. The second one provides the actual field reporting sheet that people will use to record the volume counts and quantities. The actual forms that are used in the field are slightly different from the others in that they not, do not carry full descriptions and explanations. They are designed for the field personnel to use to enter the variable data.